You will become an explorer into the mysteries of life. Why are we attracted to one person and not another? What happens when we confront our darkest fears? Can we ever become young again? What are the limits of human endurance? Celebrate the power of the human spirit in its relentless pursuit of knowledge. The more we know, the more powerful we become. Explorations. On Explorations, we discover how science helps a t-shirt salesman compete in the world's toughest race. How mastering her mind is taking this gymnast to new heights. And we step into the ring to find the body's miraculous ways of helping us win. The desire to compete and to win are instincts we all share. But now the best athletes are pushing themselves to unimaginable feats. And it's science that's helping them extend the boundaries of what their bodies can do. On the Spanish island of Lanzarote, a 28-year-old t-shirt salesman is preparing for the toughest day of his life. Michael Hanrick is attempting the Ironman Triathlon, a 2.4-mile swim followed by a 112-mile cycle ride and finally a 26-mile marathon run. The Ironman Triathlon is one of the most extreme endurance challenges devised by man. It sometimes proves fatal for its competitors. Michael Hanrick is not a world-class athlete. He's relying on science to help push his body to the edge of its limits. A few weeks before the race, Michael is at the University of Westminster in London, undergoing lactate testing. How's that, Michael? Is that all right? Yeah. Not too hard, not too easy? Yeah, it's fine. The test will gauge the point at which Michael's muscles will start to produce lactic acid and begin hurting. By measuring his corresponding heart rate, Michael can tell exactly how hard he can push his body. Your lactate levels determine uh, how far you can go for how long on the bike. When you start the race, it's very easy to go too hard. That's why things like heart rate monitors, power meters are all used by long distance triathletes so that you know you're staying within your zone. Doing an Ironman triathlon, you need to be well conditioned, and Michael's looking good for the race. We've pinpointed a number of variables during the test that, that sort of demonstrate that he is at um, uh, the, the top end of his age group in triathlon, and he should perform well in Lanzarote. 